Hello friends, welcome to my channel. In this session, we're going to learn how to create social share. If you want to share current page to Facebook, Twitter, you can do it easily. So first of all, we create one model which is open from this link. And I already created that model so we can save time. I will push this model code and a set link into the video description so you get it if you want. Uh, so let me show you. This is welcome page which which is you guys see here. So first of all, let me show you share model. I built this model with Bootstrap and some custom CSS, and also I create one component and uh, set icons. So first, let's make that model working with the Bootstrap. So for open this model, we need to write some script here. So let's write and for that we need to include that model as well in this file. So that model open share model and then let's write script. I will to open that model with jQuery and specify BTN is ID because I said BTN here and now we need to listen for event and function and hash share model this model function from the bootstrap and we need to specify here so let me correct the spelling of this model Let's make the code and this ID from this model file I specified here. So we need to specify model ID and here I added jQuery and bootstrap, uh, same in CSS as well. So now click event and define and Let's refresh. Click and you see this model. I create one component as I said uh, for Facebook, Twitter, this share icon, this link icon. Uh, let me show you. I use SVG file and create this component and specify name and show so here i just add svg files but in this model you can see i specify name and code looks very neat and clean and readable so when you want to use some svgs some images as an icon and want to use multiple place that time you should create components and if you don't know how to create components we have a tutorial i link into the description so you can find it and watch it so now next thing is we need to share this page into the twitter and facebook and also want to implement copy url basically we can copy from here but if you want to do from this button we can do it so let's see how we can share so i created two links one for facebook and second for twitter so when i click on this icon all this function from this on click attributes 
and pass Twitter and Facebook. So it's text from this and open into the new page. So let's see. Can do and it's redirect onto the Facebook page and show current URL here. But if I want to show share page here, we need to write code differently. And I'm going to show you when you click on Facebook, you see one windows in same page and you can directly share. So let's write code for it. And we need to specify options for open same page like in mo model and we need to specify options here but we need to define that options here so let me specify which options i going to specify menu bar equal to no not needed menu bar toolbar no resizable toolbar no and uh, width width is needed because we need to show in small height three hundred and save and let's see what happened let's refresh and click and you can see it's open in model so you can do it same with twitter as well but i think twitter domain is changed so let me change because now it's x so let's change and refresh and you can see but i want this model in center not this right side so we need to specify soft and left soft and left but this top and left if we specify fix it doesn't work let's see what's the result see it's from top and little bit because uh, why it's not working because all screen resolution is different if we do for one screen it doesn't work for another screen so we need to do dynamically we need to calculate sometime some people use two monitors so that time also it doesn't work so we need to do calculation dynamically for open in exact center so let me show you how we can do it and calculate top and left so first of all i'm going to specify two variables top and another one is left so let's concat this with plus and specify top same with plus left now we need this top and left calculated so we first need to calculate the width and height and based on that we can do it i have already that code so directly put and save time here but i will explain you this one for the dual screen and this windows inner width and they find width of the monitor and height of the monitor means screen and remove 600 and 300 because we specify 600 and 300 width and height of the model 
and based on that they calculate left and top and now let's save and open refresh this page click and you can see it's open exit middle so based on this calculation you can open in center now next thing is how we create this copy function when click copy and we can copy current url and paste here like control v or something so let's do this same we need to listen on click here and these functions we need to declare here in script and i'm going to create one input through the javascript and set url value into the input and execute copy command through the document dot execute command and let's see constant input and document dot body dot append child this function append one child into the body and now going to create element through document dot create element and i specify name of and type of element input so this create element create one input element and open into the this body and now i'm going to set value into the this input because we access and this input in this constant now i'm going to specify current page url through the windows dot location dot href and input dot select now let's execute the copy command document dot yeah command and let's specify action copy as argument and once this text is copied we need to destroy this input so i going to remove input parent node or dot remove child So let's see. Let's refresh. Click. Let's refresh. Click. Copy. And let's control V here. And you can see this URL. This URL. Show here now when i click i want to show something action is happen or not because when i click i don't know what happened so we should show some text here like url is copied something like that so you can see here copy url but i want to change so i'm going to use this class name or we can use this id as well so let's see what we can do here i'm going to change through jquery and specify id 
and just change text and specify COVID save and let's refresh click and you can see it's COVID and when we open URL and we can see URL here but still this copied but after few seconds it should be back original text so I think we should set time out here set time out here like and change it again so I am going to copy this and put here and specify three seconds and set copy URL save and let's refresh click see text is copied and again back to copy URL so that's the way you can copy URL you can share on Facebook you can share on Twitter so you can do it easily thank you for watching video please do not forget to subscribe my channel thank you